Well, a lot of new fallout after the release of the latest batch of Hillary Clinton's emails. The Washington Times reports that one in 20 of the thousands of messages just released yesterday contain classified info, though they weren't marked that way at the time, and evidence of hacking attempts on her server out of Russia. Okay, Megan, what did you think about this? I mean, I Who's surprised? Most of it's been uh, uh, omitted. I mean, this is the exact opposite of what she said was in there. This is why she's not going to be president. Queen Hillary thinks that everything is above her, that she doesn't have to do anything. She doesn't have to abide by the rules, even if it means sacrificing our national security. Well, I know some of the investigators have talked to us, um, and I remember about four months ago, one of them specifically was telling me off camera that, you know, they knew of these, these intel breaks that have happened with government employees also, as well as some famous people. In fact, even Carly Fiorina has mentioned her mm -hmm. information was stolen, mm -hmm. and they felt it came through a backdoor mm -hmm. way. Not saying it happened that way, but I know they were looking at the possibility that somebody did hack through, and that's the way they got through the door, so to speak, and into U.S. information. So mm -hmm. I'm not saying that's the case, but this just goes to show, and it's been done by others, too, that this is absolutely wrong, that they knew that they were doing it wrong, yet they did it because they didn't well, care. Well, this latest batch of emails proves that our national security was put at more risk than we originally thought, and there's more emails to come. So but we know. knew this. Yeah. We know this, and it's only going to keep leaking out, and I can't wait to see what's actually in it, and I hope we finally get some clarity on exactly what happened the with Benghazi. The question is, did greatest... she click on those phishing attempts by the hackers yeah. oh to gosh. see about her parking tickets? One of the greatest <laughs> threats we face as a nation is cyber warfare. Yes. We're already and this facing person it. can't get her email. Yeah, there were five wait, of those, by the way. If she can't do it Secretary of State, I don't know if I'd gift her with the highest office. We're staying right here for Outnumbered Overtime. We'll see you tomorrow. Back at noon Eastern, happening now, starts now.